since I still have access to Humble Bundle Trove, yes, I am currently a subscriber, I decided to make a new series called What's in the Trove? And the first seven contestants will either have gotten here because they look really odd or they look like they belong on new grounds. So first of all, rules for What's in the Trove? This series may continue but in order to qualify, you need to A, not really be a real game, B, maybe be really, really, really weird, or C, look like you belong on new grounds. So yeah, the first series, we actually have seven entries. I have seen some others, but they look either super pretentious, or just not very fun. First entry will be Kimmy! Kimmy gets an entry because it looks like it could belong on Newgrounds. Let me show you what I mean. That is what I mean. It could also be super pretentious. But that's Kimmy, and we're gonna explore Kimmy. And explore Kimmy really good. Second entry, Quiet City. Quiet City gets in for looking like it belongs in new grounds. I don't actually know how fun Quiet City is. It looks like it's about pressing on circles. So we're gonna press them circles good. We're gonna press them circles good. Entry number three, Fortune 499. It looks like it's a rock, paper, scissors game, which is at least to say weird. So I do not know whether Fortune 499 is here because it could very well also be on Newgrounds. Or because it's straight up odd. I am gonna put it into the odd category. So let's battle them beasts with rock, paper, scissors and see how we do, I suppose. Okay, entry number four that gets in for being really fucking weird. Elephant in the room. I think we can have a lot of fun with this one. It is all about being not spotted as a giant elephant. I honestly really love the idea. It looks like it also has great frame rate. I hope that the frame rate is better than what's shown. Entry number five. Oh dear! It gets here for looking like somebody had to be drunk to do this. So yes, we will smash them beer, and we will see for how long we can smash them beer. I'm astounded that this is a thing. I'm kind of curious what kind of thing that is, by the way. It, it's, it's amazing. Moving up, entry number six will be Cut and Run. It's about growing a giant sword by cutting things in order to combat a meteor. If this is not odd, I don't know what is. And the last entry... We're gonna be a murderous vacuum cleaner because... Of course this is a thing. And I am actually highly, highly curious about this one because this one also enters on being weird. But I think it's the good kind of weird. I think it's the kind of weird where people will legitimately like you as a game. Kind of weird. So 
I hope that you're gonna join me for the series of What is in the Trove, which may continue after seven games if you guys express interest for anything else that's in the Trove. However, it cannot be real games. Real games like games that actually released outside of Humble Bundle a long while ago and have, um, sort of a following. So, for example, Torchlight 2, Rios, Meat Boy, Limbo, and the likes would immediately get disqualified. But hey, there's a lot of weird stuff over here. Um, and it's the weird stuff that we're gonna explore. So, hope you're gonna join me, and thank you for watching this video.